Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Lindsay and I bring you content on all things clean beauty and skincare. If you're not already subscribed, I would love to have you and if you are already, thank you. In today's video, I'm going to be introducing you guys to a new skincare line that I've been trying out called Bold and Bear. They were kind enough to sponsor this video, so I'm really excited to share this brand with you. They have an amazing mission statement and some really interesting products, so let's get right into it. Before I get into the brand and the products, this is my go-to skincare routine lately if I want something really simple. There are some days where I want a really like intricate routine and do a lot of steps, but there's other days I come home, I just want to take my makeup off and literally go to bed, and I feel like these these two products from Bold and Bear are perfect for that. So, so I just wanted to mention that. So if you prefer a low maintenance skincare routine, these products are great for you. Or if you just want something for those days that you don't feel like doing a ton of skincare, these would also be great. So let me get into a little more info about the brand and the products that I got to try out. Bold and Bear is a newly launched skincare brand. They are a new indie brand. They are vegan, cruelty free, and of course use natural ingredients, which I know we all love. This is what this channel is all about. And they have two products in their line. First off is the Bear Elixir. I kept the boxes to show you because I think they're really gorgeous, nice minimal packaging. And then the other product is the Purity Mask. So both of these together will be like the perfect simple skincare routine. I'm gonna get into some more info about these products. So let me go ahead and open them up. I'm gonna go ahead and start with the Purity Mask because this is the first product I would use in my routine. I will be including a little demo of me using the product, so just stay tuned for the application part of this. But let me go ahead and open this and I will show you guys what the product looks like. First off, it does come with this cute little scoop, which I think is great so you don't have to put your fingers in it and get it um, not really contaminated, but you don't have to get bacteria into the mask. And this is what the packaging looks like. It's really gorgeous. I love how it's just a minimal design. I'm a fan of minimal packaging. I don't like anything too colorful. And plus it's just like more Instagrammable. Shouldn't judge skincare that way, but it's just a point I'm adding. It comes with a little lid on here so it doesn't spill everywhere. Here is the texture of the mask. Like I said, I will include a close up of the texture and me applying it in the little application part of this video to come. First, I just wanted to give you a brief overview of what the ingredients are in this. This is a clay mask, but it's not like a dry one. It's already pre-mixed, which I love because I don't like mixing like dry masks with water. I feel like it's just so messy and I just like never get the right proportions. So I think this is great. This has Moroccan clay and witch hazel in it, which are really great at purifying the skin if you have any sort of blemishes going on, or if you just have oily skin in general, those are really great ingredients to have in your skincare. This also contains turmeric and kelp, which are great at refining your skin. So, so those are to refine your skin if you have any sort of acne scars or just uneven texture. I don't know if you guys have like heard of turmeric in skincare before, but it has amazing anti-inflammatory properties. It's really good to ingest and put on your skin. It is bright yellow. If you get like a turmeric mask, like you know it's bright yellow, that's messy. I like how it's just a small amount in this mask. And then this also contains peony and cockadoo plum, which I have seen cockadoo plum in some other skincare products before that I've really liked. It has a ton of vitamin C in it, which is of course amazing for brightening any sort of dullness or acne scars. It's really been like a hero ingredient for any skincare products that I try. I noticed that if they have cockadoo plum in them, they work really well for my skin. So I would say the thing that I find most unique about this mask and what I really love about it, it is a clay based mask and it has a lot of purifying ingredients in it. It's called the Purity Mask, but it doesn't over dry my skin or sort of just like make me like dry up. I don't know if you've ever used a clay mask and kind of left it on for too long and it kind of just like really dehydrates your skin and afterwards you feel like you need to like put a lot of moisturizer on. I find that this one doesn't really do that. Even if I leave it on for too long, I feel like when I wash it off, my skin looks really nice and balanced and healthy, which I appreciate in a mask. I don't want it to over dry my skin. I like something that's gentle but still effective and I would say this is definitely what the mask offers. And the scent on it, it's not, it doesn't really smell like anything in particular. Maybe a little bit of clay but really not anything strong. I always like to mention the scent of products because I know I'm pretty sensitive to fragrance and a lot of people are too. So I think that's a helpful point to add that this doesn't have any really distinguished scent to it. I use this mask two to three times a week. I usually only mask about that two to three times a week. 
So on those days that I do want a really simple routine, I think this is a great product because it does a really good job at purifying my skin so I don't have to put on a bunch of products to really treat any blemishes or acne I have. I could just use this and then use the other product and I feel like I'm good to go. So overall, I think this is a really beautiful mask. I think the brand has really good values as well. Their mission statement is they want to make women feel comfortable in their skin and be as bold as they want to be, which I think is great. Always a good message to spread. So let me get on to the other product I have from them. The second product in the line is called their Bare Elixir. First off, I think this packaging is really gorgeous. I love the bottle, love the square bottle as well. I do enjoy that it has a dropper so you can control how much that comes out. This is a really interesting product because it contains hyaluronic acid and peptides, which are like two saviors for my skin at least. I know those do amazing things for your skin and I definitely notice a difference when I use those in my skincare routine. This also contains a grapefruit root, which has vitamins A, C, and E. We all know vitamin C is good for brightening, vitamin E is good for scars, and then vitamin A is good for just the overall tone of your skin, so obviously that ingredient is going to help target a lot of different skin concerns. And then for a nice moisturization boost, it does contain oils, but none of them are pore clogging or comedogenic, I can never say that word, so I just say pore clogging. So that's what I really love about this because some oils, although they are great for your skin, if you have sensitive skin or kind of just like prone to getting acne from heavy products, then some oils can break you out even though they're amazing for your skin. They could just be a little bit too heavy and your skin can't really breathe, but this contains really lightweight oils that aren't gonna suffocate your skin and they blend in beautifully. This makes the perfect makeup primer. I've been using this at night, but also I love using it in the morning. You can also add this into your foundation and it gives you like such a glow. It's the perfect lightweight texture, which is if I'm gonna use an oil, like I love when it's lightweight, it just sinks in immediately. It leaves you with a nice silky smooth base, but it doesn't feel heavy. It doesn't kind of like, if you use an oil at night, you know it can kind of like come off on your pillow if it doesn't sink into your skin immediately. But this one does a really good job at sinking in and just leaving me looking really glowy and healthy. So you do get one full ounce of product in here, which is the typical serum or oil size in most skincare products. So you can get both of these products in a bundle on their site. I will link both of them below if you guys wanted to check them out. Like I said, they're a really great brand. I love the mission statement. They're vegan, cruelty free, and all natural. So that was all for my overview of the products. Both those together, like I said, would be perfect if you enjoy a simple skincare routine or just want that option when you're not up to doing a full routine, which I feel like is me most of the time. But anyway, thank you to Bold and Bear for sponsoring this video. I had a ton of fun sharing these products for you guys. If you wanna see me do any more brand reviews, let me know what brand you'd love to see me review in the comments below. Give me a like if you enjoyed this video and also don't forget to subscribe. Thank you again for watching and I will see you in my next video.